Hey everyone, welcome to Gentle PSD. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Today in this exciting tutorial we will be learning about how to place anything inside your video in After Effects. Let's take a look at what we are going to create and learn. That looks super awesome. This tutorial will have good insights and tricks about After Effects, so be sure to check it. Before we begin please make sure to hit the subscribe button and bell icon for more amazing tutorials like this. Without any further ado let's begin. Import the stock videos and images to our project panel. Here we have a three stocks along with our video, a Twitter message mockup, a subscribe image and a 3D model hazard soldier. We will create a new composition using our stock video. Drag the video onto the composition icon that you want to use. We now have this video of the walking on a small street by Nippon Wandering TV YouTube channel. Go to Effects and Presets panel type in 3D Camera Tracker. Drag the tracker onto our video to start the tracking process. As you see our camera tracker started its analyzing as soon as I dropped on the video layer. It will now track our camera movements on our video and also creates a track point for us. Now we have this different colors of dots throughout our video. These are all called camera track points. To explain it in simple terms, consider this points as a glue. If you put anything on those points it will stuck like it glued. If I move my cruiser over it you can see that it's making this round shape. This is the placeholder indicator. I will now show you how to place a text on the wall using this. Now select a perfect point to place our text on the wall. Click it select it and right click on it. Choose text and camera layer. As you see it created a text on the wall. I will change the text to tutorial. Take the text tool and type in tutorial. Press S on your keyboard to bring the scale and decrease its size. Since it's a 3D layer please feel free to use the X, Y and Z plane to move around the text as you want until you satisfied with its position. You can change the color in the character panel. If I play it, As you see our text stuck on a wall like a glued poster. It looks amazing. You can use this techniques, for your vlogs and films, which will be awesome. We now know how to create a text on a wall. I will now show you how to place an image in your video. As you already know we can't see the tracker points, 
because it's not selected. Select the video layer go to effects control panel and select camera trackers. We can see the tracker points. Again select a perfect placeholder using the cruiser. Choosing the correct perspective is very important. If you choose some random placeholder it will be difficult to manage and place it in the right place. So move around until you see something like this. Click on it and right click then select create solid. As you see it created a solid layer in our wall. Decrease its size using the scale on the solid layer. We will now replace this solid layer with our Twitter mockup. Go to project panel make sure the solid layer is selected. Hold out and drag this Twitter image onto our solid. As you see our solid layer is replaced with our Twitter image. Again decrease its size. If you see any misalignment you can always use the rotation and orientation on our image layer. Press R to bring the rotation and orientation. Just play around with these options, you will master it soon enough. After you fixed the minor adjustments, let's play it. That looks super good. Now we know how to place an image in a video. This time we'll place an image on the moving subjects. Here we have this man on a bicycle heading towards us. Since he have a carrier in front of his bicycle, so we will put something on there. Choose the perfect place to make a solid. Right click and create a new solid. Use the rotation and scale to bring the shape to its ideal size and position. Now go to project panel, make sure that the solid layer is selected. Hold out and bring our subscribe image onto our solid layer. Rotate it. Decrease its size. If I play it, that looks super awesome. We now placed an image on a moving subject and it looks amazing. Even if I bring the indicator back to start, you can see that our subscribe image is stuck with that bike. Speaking of subscribe please hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorials like this. You don't have to worry about not working with first track points. You can always place anything anywhere and it will be on that place for all of that video. Now we know how to place a text, image and on moving subjects. We are now going to place a 3D object in our video and it's going to look super awesome. Take your indicator to the end of our video. We will place our hazard soldier here so create a new solid on the road. That looks good. If I drag our 3D soldier onto our timeline, place him here. If I move the indicator, as you see the 3D model is moving with us and not fit anywhere in the video. That's because we haven't placed it on our track points. Press Ctrl Z to undo. Make sure that the solid layer is selected. Hold out and drag the 3D hazard soldier onto our layer. 
Please don't panic as you see our hazard soldier just got sandwiched on our road. Press R on your keyboard to bring the rotation and orientation. We will make him stand with our orientation and use the rotation to make him stand straight. That looks super good. Push him further in the Z and Y space axis, so can make him at stand at the other side of the road. As you see we have a shadow casted on him because of the light. If you want this 3D objects and all the previous and future tutorial project files please visit our Patreon page. Link is in the description. After you placed our soldier in the right place now let's play it. That looks amazing. We now learned how to place anything inside a video, and I hope you learned something from this tutorial. We finally at the end of our tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any doubt please feel free to comment in the comment section. I will be more than happy to help. Please hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorials like this. Hit the like button if you like this video. Until our next tutorial stay happy. Thank you.